Hello everyone, uh, welcome to this video. So someone in uh, comments on one of my videos asked if I can do a video on how to patch uh, the Status 2D to DWM. So let's get started. Uh, as you can see, we have a nice background image. So let's get that terminal and cd into slash temp. Let's clone the DWM and https it that suckless and that org and slash DWM and cd into DWM and let's get the patch. I'm going to open the browser. Okay. Go to suckless and go to DWM patches and let's look for status 2D, which is right uh, here. And you have two lot of options you can use uh, if you want uh, the status 2D and the sys tray, so you then have uh, to patch this is tray to your DWM. You just use this one with the uh, Status 2D and this tray, but the one I'm going to use is this one, uh, which is that's just the sys tray. I'm gonna uh, select all of that, copy it, and go to my DWM. I'm gonna make a file and just call it a x.diff, which is a diff file, and uh, I'm just going to run patch and uh, that diff file so you don't you don't need actually to run patches patch is just uh, an alias to this command which is uh, in my bash rc so you have to run this one but in my case i'm just going to run the patch so everything was successful so let's make and install it make install and that's basically it so now uh, you restart DWM I have a key binding for that to restart DWM so I'm gonna hit that and it's going to go to this uh, this build that we just built uh, all right uh, let's go back to see some examples of this. Uh, okay. All right. Let's get some examples. Uh, we have an example in here. We have in to run this command. So basically, what I'm going to do is just make a, a, a shell script out of this one. So. Uh, Call it uh, call it status uh, status dot sh and uh, bin bash and we paste that line that I just copied, which is basically just running exit root and the name is the how we should uh, do the colors and the uh, here is there some square I think yeah so let's save that and make it executable schmod plus x and script and we run the script now as you can see the status changed and let's say if I can change some colors uh, for example let's change this one uh, to blue for example and let's change this uh, rectangle to and uh, let's change it to green I guess yeah and status as you can see uh, change the text this text to blue and the rectangle to green and that's pretty much it you can uh, have your own 
script that uh, runs, uh, well, probably not text, but uh, some CPU stuff, RAM, whatever you want to have in here. And probably add it to your to your DWM to start automatically. Okay, that's basically everything you have to do. So if you have some issues with the, adding this uh, status to the patched to a, a patched DWM, basically you have applied some patches like a, a bar padding or uh, the alpha patch or uh, even the sysstray and you have issues with that i have made some patch patches or patches uh, that uh, apply all three of them so let me show you that so you just uh, go to my dot files and uh, look for this directory source go into it and you see the dwm fixed patches and uh, basically what I made is this uh, what is it status 2d and plus the bar padding patch and also I made the status 2d bar padding and sysstray all three of them I haven't uh, checked the alpha patch if it works with the status 2d but uh, this one has all three patches combined uh, you just add this one and you have the sysstray and the power padding and also the status 2d working okay so uh, check out the patches and uh, thank you for watching and see you in the next one